Did you know that your issues are in your tissues? Like this one for sure, <gasps> you know, when you cry, but actually in the connective tissues that are within your body. Your body is so smart that it literally holds all of the emotions and also the physical manifestations of what's happening in your body. I mean, if it's cold, we, we tighten up and so that impacts the tissues in our body. And when we think of things, all of our emotions, our traumas, our whatever it is, it's also stored in our tissue. And the tissues are something, if you're having an issue, you can't go to the doctors and be like, hey, can you tell me what's happening? So with that being said, I have a little challenge for you. Instead of relying on a Fitbit or Apple Watch or whatever it is, take some time to connect with yourself. And it's so easy to do. I mean, you take a tool, a gua sha, these are scraping tools. The term gua sha was termed by traditional Chinese medicine, but a lot of different cultures use similar practices. The Mayans have stone massages. In Ayurveda, they have abhyanga, which is the ultimate form of self-love. But the difference is when you use your fingers to touch yourself, your receptors feel like, oh, this is gold, this is cotton, this is skin, this is a stone. But when you use a tool to touch yourself, what your body feels is all of the textures underneath, whether it's feeling the actual bones, muscles within your body, or a little bit of inflammation. So why am I telling you this today? We're about to have a full moon in the sign of Aries, and Aries rules the body parts of the head and neck. So it is the perfect time. Our head has literally, our head, like our skull, our entire skull, is full of pressure points that connect to so many emotions and so many different parts of your body. So if you have one of our tools, whether it's essential element, which is available until the full moon, or if you have a rock with care, which we sell all the time, I encourage you to take the jagged edge and literally just place it in a whole bunch of different parts of your skull. Doing that alone, I mean, it just wakes everything up. But in addition to that, you are connecting with different pressure points and you're going to feel it in your body, which is pretty amazing. And you will learn things about yourself, I promise. Maybe not the first time because you're going to be judging what's going on. Maybe not the second time, but afterwards, close your eyes and just do this. And I mean, not only are you going to feel into your body and start connecting with yourself so you don't have to rely on technology to tell you what's going on inside. I mean, our body is magnificent. Why are we relying on an Apple Watch to tell us things about herself. It's fine if you're curious, but don't let data dictate what's going on in your body when you should be the one knowing what's happening within your body. I hope that makes sense. But take the tool all over your skull, particularly whew, the back part, and just see what happens. Each part of our brain, I won't get into it, or each part of our skull is associated with a logical mind, a creative mind. Um, know yourself and I'd love for you to leave a comment in terms of what you're feeling but do that as we approach the full moon because the full moon it's a super moon in the sign of Aries which is encouraging us to get in touch with this part of our body but then also don't forget to just run it over all your tissues literally three minutes a day is all I do I take this baby it's like barely any pressure and what's going on is I'm like feeling anywhere where there's knots. I am doing lymphatic drainage, which is like the current hip term, but like guys, lymphatic drainage is like coconut or turmeric or avocado. I mean, it's just the current, you know, the current buzzword, but like you, it's, you need a holistic, you know, experience. And the only way you can do that is if you connect with yourself, you will learn so much about yourself in terms of mind and body. You're going to start hearing the word somatic everywhere, which is the mind body connection. Why? Because you're truly connected. If you're stressed out, you go like this. That's the mind that's getting you to tense up. If you're mad, you might put your hands, you know, in like a fist like this and walk around. Or if you have an emotion, and it shows up in your face like you can actually help yourself by using tools like this you don't want these wrinkles well hello let's just kind of iron them out and what's happening not only am I getting rid or relaxing these muscles so those don't 
the muscles don't go in to form wrinkles, but guess what? I'm also creating space here within the fascia and I can think clearer. It's pretty amazing. So my challenge to you is grab your essential element or your rock with care and literally use it all over your body. Take this from a woman who's 43 and has had a lot of stuff happen physically, more than the average human. Um, had a decade of like just breaking so many parts of my body. My body shut down after I had my son completely from the neck down um, because of toxins accumulating in my body. I don't talk about this one too much, but um, yeah, I mean, I have learned a lot about my body and now am my own healer. Obviously, I will rely on um, physicians and on other um, holistic practitioners to help me with my health issues. However, when I connect with myself, I'm able to help them because I know more about myself. So grab this. It's like, you know, I created this brand to make the world a better place. And I thought making the world a better place is by having people connect to themselves because one of my favorite quotes by Radha Nath Swami is the root of our disconnection from others is due to the disconnection from ourselves and you know that started with the internet and it's happening more and more and more as we rely on data for things like don't look at your apple watch just feel when you wake up in the morning did i sleep well um how is my breath the apple watch is not going to tell you that but your tissues are going to tell you that if you're able to connect with them on a regular basis all right i hope this doesn't come across as a rant but it is such important information that i just wanted to get out there and share all right peace and rock with care um if you enjoyed this video please subscribe i would love 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 that because i really want to get this information out into the world i love your subscription if you have any comments let me know it helps out a small business like mine so much and um yeah i hope you take the steps to connecting with yourself because makes the world a better place all right peace